we got some splendid May weather outside today, seeing more and more sunshine as the day progresses so far. Temperature-wise, warmer readings to the north. It's 70 degrees in Upper Sandusky, Ottawa, almost 70 in Finley, 64 degrees in Lima at the top of the hour. Noticeably cooler in our southern locations because of some thicker clouds that are a little more stubborn. But even down there, we are starting to get some hints of sunshine, so that will start to do some work on those temperatures. We noticed a trend here on the satellite and radar that decrease in the clouds, so we're getting enough sunshine out there now that things are going to warm up nicely, and we will remain quiet this afternoon with light winds out of the northeast, 5 to 10 miles an hour. With that sunshine, we're going to see temperatures continue to climb nicely into those 70s. So as far as this week ahead, it's really a pretty nice week. We do have a chance tomorrow for some of us to get rain. Now, if you're in Lima, I don't think we're going to get much at all, if anything. North, we're not going to see a drop tomorrow. And then south towards Sydney, you guys have a decent shot to get in on some showers Tuesday. So we'll keep in a chance of there tomorrow. But then after that, from tomorrow night all the way through early Friday, we're looking good. Friday late in the day, we'll see the chance for some showers and storms. That chance will be highest Friday night. And then moving out, it looks like, as we go throughout today, Saturday. So this will be a front sweeping through, and then we'll clear out again as the weekend progresses. So looking at that skycast, very nice weather this afternoon. We'll call it partly sunny out there, so get out there and enjoy. With all the low humidity, it just makes such a very pleasant air mass out there. We head into tonight. Those conditions remain quiet. Clouds will start to increase again later tonight all ahead of our week disturbance that arrives on Tuesday. So tomorrow will be cloudier than today. As we look at our sky cast, we notice by late morning there will be a band of light rain south of Lima around Salina, the Wapakoneta, Sydney. But if you're watching from areas north, don't worry about rain. You're going to stay nice and dry up there tomorrow. And even around Lima, don't expect much out of this. I think we're going to stay mainly dry. A lot of that staying shoved just off to the south. So the question still is the northern extent. I would say mainly from Rockford to around Crowdersville over towards Kenton and points south. The best chance to get that rain on our Tuesday. And then by tomorrow evening, we're clearing out. Very pleasant weather overall for Tuesday evening. We're going to cool down, though, with a cold front coming through. We notice the winds will be out of the north Wednesday morning, and that is going to drive in some cooler air. In fact, Wednesday, only looking at temperatures reaching into the mid 60s but it will be dry. So again, that forecast tomorrow, more clouds than sun. The chance for showers will be greatest around midday as that weak disturbance slides through. Again, mainly south of Lima. That 70 forecast, again, not looking too shabby. We see those temperatures tomorrow right around 70. I think we could get, even get warmer if we end up a bit drier. So we'll see how that holds. Now, Wednesday and Thursday, pick days of the week with sunny skies all around. Temperatures 65 Wednesday. But by Thursday morning, we're down to 40 degrees, so a bit of a chill here in the forecast. But we're back up to 70 with that May sunshine Thursday afternoon. And as we get into the weekend, we may start with some showers early Saturday, but otherwise looking pretty good as we head into early next week.